down by like by what's his face. Like okay, so everyone's here, here, right? It looks like everyone's here. Yep, I just Looks went through it. the, uh, all my function keys and everybody showed up. Great. Alrighty. So we're all function keys so. here? <laughs> <laughs> we're just punching keys. So the first part, just beat all the portals, run around like crazy people. It's awesome. Just follow the crowd. Yeah, there's nothing special about the first part. It's just, if a portal keeper appears, kill him. Otherwise, just beat the portals. Any portal can be beat on it. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna have to worry about portal keepers. I don't think so either. Whee! Shroud lag! I love it so much! Hey, it's not a real shroud without it. <laughs> Now, I think I did publish, I haven't published all the videos from Galanda's Shroudpalooza, but I did post the video of us failing Shroud because of the lag, because a portal keeper did not get killed in this first part. That is what happened to me when I tried to solo Shroud. I had a portal keeper come up after like five or six portals, and I couldn't find him. I ran around every damn place where a portal spawned, and I could not find portal keeper. So, of I course, I became co-terminus and I failed. It was, it was Yeah, co-terminus. It's, it's, it's horrible. And we were all frozen in the lag spike because of our instant doing whatever recovery stuff it needed to do. And, and, I, and he appeared and I was like, oh my gosh, we are going to fail. And sure enough, so that's the only thing I've published on YouTube so, YouTube so far. Though so I think Portavan has the whole, you know, the whole three hours up on the DDO stream. Hey, hey Bonnie, uh, uh, Queen was streaming earlier. Wasn't she was doing some other game though, wasn't she? Yeah, I think so. She was doing like Arcade, I think. Yeah. Oh, what did she mention? I should like pitch this Saturday. I am running three hours of Shroud Run. So if you're looking for stuff in Shroud or you want to just like have some fun, look for my LFMs. I'm also going to be streaming it on the DDO stream channel. And giving away a turbine point code. Starting what time? Starting at 2 p.m. Eastern, running until about 5 p.m. Eastern. So anybody who wants to come out would be great. I suppose I could talk to you to save me a spot that I used for the last one. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, because I even Cause I want you to get into at least one of them. Well, I've got my writers group meeting normally from two to four. I'm thinking I can duck out a lot of it early. I don't normally say <laughs> But this is this is special discretion. Plus, it's the last show, so I think I can do whatever I want. <laughs> <laughs> I would appreciate that. Ooh, Troncolet Exterminator Three. Go even. Go even. Uh, just fair word of warning for the next phase because they're going to screw up aggro. We've got four things we've got to kill at once. Uh, not a good idea to have pet, I mean, cosmetic pets are fine, but no fun pets because they can screw up aggro and kill things before we're ready. Right. Yeah, I've had my uh, summon pet do that. So what we're going to have is four red names that all have to die within a few seconds of each other. So what we do is there's a barrier and we pull them there and we beat them down to almost nothing and then we pull them apart and and if we have the lion or the fire alley we kill those left. Yes, I will. I have my pants. It's my job. Screw up the puzzle. Um, the D100 high for my shard. Actually, low. Mine's for low. D100 low. 
double walls seem to grow. Well, if you can't both roll B100 because we won't. Well, unless everybody's you. Know. We won't. Yeah, I guess. Oh, yeah, I guess. That wasn't me. High and left. <laughs> Somebody's already doing it for two. Uh, if you're new, when you step in here, you want to try to head to towards the, uh, somebody said a mic at all. Yeah. Do not go into the middle because that's where the red names are and we don't want to pull them before we're ready. We want to get the trash cleared first. Who's doing the diamond? Or the... Yeah. Crystal. Okay, red. Crystal. Red. 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 Okay. Red. 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 Red.
and I've been doing, I guess, just leads only for the past couple of months. Okay. Plus, you get an extra chest. You get extra chests on the harder difficulties. All right, I'm in a room with a maze, but but I don't know the pattern. I agree. I'm in the the circle puzzle. I really don't know this one. I really don't know. If you um okay, so sometimes in the circle puzzle, with yours, is it? Do you have a general idea of what direction you are, or like, is it a three by three, four by four buttons, or five by five? Three by three. All right, I found you, Ratchel. And uh, watch blades, Rat. Oh, don't step. There's glowy runes on the floor, like big circles of, of gold runes. Do not step on those. They will spawn hard, wilting, and it hurts. So, Rattel, I'm kind of doing this by stepping on buttons below ones that aren't lit. So... And this one's really easy. I just work my way down the puzzle and step below things that, that aren't lit. And then uh, once so everything's the, lit, the it's all. The top was uh, on my side. Yeah, but you can arbitrarily pick which side is the top and just and just treat it that way. Oh, now we're going to run back to the south and pick up fountains. Um, okay, follow me to the south. <laughs> and don't run on the gold don't symbols. Try to avoid stepping on them. Anybody need any help with their puzzle? The circle puzzle needed help, I think. Yeah. I'll need an opener, though. <laughs> okay, I'll run over there and unlock it. Unlock it. So, yeah. um, Rat Tail, just grab water and run around. Like, click on the fountain and pick up some water. And then run around, and if you see a puzzle that's solved, click on the fountain and fill it with water. Don't put water in if the puzzle's not completely solved yet, and don't break the crystals over the puzzle. Oh, yeah. Because I, that way we can lose out on the uh, extra two chests underwater. As long as it's not the last puzzle, you can click on the fountain. But it's better to be safe than sorry. I don't know when it's purified already. Um, you'll see water flowing. Okay. So like, so like... All the buttons will be lit, um, and so there won't be any water in the fountain if it's good to go. If it's good for you to click on it. Okay. I don't remember how to do the 3x3s. Three um, do you know, like, in what general direction you are? Like, maybe uh, east or east or Let me check the... Shoot, I don't know. I just see a bunch of ants. You're probably in the north 5x5, five five, uh, Shinter. Yeah, that's where he's at. Masculina. You want me to get it, or do you want to do it? Well, you get it. I just went into a three by three. What did you? Is, are you the one who wanted help, Gizoid? I went in to help, but I forgot the uh, the way of doing three by threes. All right. Well, I'll get this. Yeah. And if somebody's doing the puzzle, oh, don't it. walk on it while they're doing it because that will screw them up. Okay, I That's will run you need the unlocking on the north. It looks like everything's solved, we just need to put water in the last thing. Okay, where's the last one? 
the north maybe? North maybe? It's always north 5x5 five five or southwest 5x5. Five five. <laughs> Usually. Oh, no, the southwest. No, the northeast is good. It's the southeast. I said southwest, yeah, no, southeast 5x5. Five five. It's, it's, it's always a two. Bonnie, remember that last shot of Palooza you did and you got rainbowed? Oh, I didn't have any water. <laughs> yeah, I got rainbow. How could I forget? All right, I'm sure that was confusing for first timers and stuff, but no, I could call one. Thank you. It gets better. <laughs> I just pick up water again. Oh my god. Yeah, for first timers in here, um, if you're too slow for doing the puzzles and stuff, there will be. Ooh, medium Eberron shard. Can always use those. Make me some shard trinkets of demonic enhancement. That's what I need. My inventory is already full. I'm a real I, uh, this guy here, this, uh, vendor, you can sell there if you need inventory yeah. space. I don't recommend having him repair unless you've got something broken because he's really expensive. Yeah, like I usually buy um, uncharged things because I have to end out my thing, my um, my runs with crunching a weapon. It's like tradition. What the ditch? What the ditch? What the ditch? Hey, how about these essences? I'm taking too long. You guys can all go ahead and click. We can click on the altar and you guys can go if you want. The portal to the challenge. <laughs> 20 grand for repair. We don't have to wait for everybody. <laughs> Remember, in this part, uh, when we kill the devils, they're going to spawn blades. When Harry comes down, there's going to be blades that circle around. And if you're squishy stand, uh, and you're ranged, just like stand back here. Yeah. Just try to be aware of where the blades are in relation to your body. Healers, do you want to save a devil to let the blades clear or just go? We'll just go. Kill everything. No mercy. Yeah, it's not like the old days, dude. It's just total surge. It, it amazes me, I run this now, I run this with Legend Build, who builds to hundreds and hundreds of completions, and you still see people dying in this part of Shroud. Oh, I do it all the time. I will not pay attention to where the blades are, and I'll be on something that's pretty squishy. Um, I think this is where the, the pit fiend poison has gotten me, and I've gotten con damage and become helpless and died. Also, the blades are going to keep, they're circling blades, they're going to be closing in tighter and tighter. And so, if somebody on the outside could let us know when they're getting in close enough so that you can jump out yeah. if you need to.
nice DPS going on here. Okay, the blades are closing in. So if you're if you're afraid of being squished, you might want to leave. Yeah, that boy's got this. Got this. Got this. Nice. Nice. Now on this last one, do not quit. We've got a newbie. We, uh, Bonnie, if you don't mind, I would love to be the one to talk if you're jumping. It's yeah, one of my favorite things to do with Shroud. Do not do click not. the portal to go through. Because we do have a first timer, so we've got a shot at the extra chest. And we don't want anybody clicking the portal too soon and ruining that for us. Yeah, it only works for first timers, so, you know. Yep. Only first time on, on, on an account, and I mean the chances are, are very, very slim, but the cool thing is basically if you click the exact right spot in the portal, we'll all get teleported to a secret room, and in that, there's going to be two chests in that room, and they've got, besides shroud ingredients and uh, supreme power shards, you have a demon shot plus three tombs, and a Plus four. You're playing it up too much. Hey, you're at you're the altar. You're at the altar. You're at the altar. You're at the altar. Okay, too many people talking about Thank you. Uh, now wait, who's our new person? Who's our first timer? Who's our first timer? Me. Okay, right tail. Uh, when we click the portal, there's going to be the or the altar. The portal's going to pop up here like usual. Uh, you should be able to do this without jumps. If anybody can give him jump, that might not be a bad idea just to be on the safe side. Uh, if you stand on the ground, you won't be able to hit high enough. So basically what you're going to want to do is stand on the altar, try to click just like a hair above the exact center of the portal, like jump off and click the portal. and I think I've only seen this actually done maybe once or twice, but if you click the exact right spot, we get teleported to the secret room, and yeah. you should just you should probably not buff, because buffs sometimes can interfere. Here. Uh, yeah, you're going to lose, you're, you're, we're going to lose our buffs when we go through the portal, so aside from somebody maybe wanting to give right tail jump, I wouldn't buff right now. Don't forget, too, if you don't actually hit the portal, though, dude, you will kill us and the raid will be over. Oh, that's an old... Oh, stop. I hate when people scare newbies like that. No, if you don't hit the portal just right, we'll just get teleported to the, the, the end fight. It's no big deal. You get, we'll get teleported into that Lord of the uh, Rings game. Yeah, that's eh, not scary. Yeah, ba basically, you're, you're going to either that's teleport even us to a secret than... room or to the end fight. That's so... Even... Get teleported into Middle Earth? Oh my god. I hope he does it right. I don't want to go to Lord of the Rings online. <laughs> uh, and uh, some people say mouse look is easier, and, and I personally can't stand mouse look, so that's really just a matter of personal preference. But basically, like, line up just the exact center of the portal and just aim when you click it. Jump off, click it, and try to get just, like, one tiny little hair above the center because you're going to be on your way down as you're clicking. So. Well, whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready. Yeah, good luck. Drum roll. Yeah, jump off from on the altar or you'll be. Oh, what the fuck? You what the up? hell? Where the hell did you click? Oh, shit, we're all dead? <laughs> No. You guys were talking about how did you dare not tell people that they could get tell that they could die because that makes it so much funnier when they do. I fell for that trick so 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 hard my first shroud. I was almost in tears. I, I, I like I like I was just surprised. But actually, which would be the worst threat that the whole party could die or that the whole party could be fed to Middle Earth? I don't know. Uh, I was starting to get, I was starting to get suspicious to know her, like, talking about it on the live. Uh, if you're squishy and you have ranged, you can jump up here where I am, 
and you'll be saying, we oversold it. We, we, we did kind of, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, he, he saw it coming. I went and got popcorn. It was funny. It is old. <laughs> when I when it first was done to me, I did. I felt so bad for like five seconds. You know, through it. <laughs> I just went the first time I did the route, nobody told me anything, and so when everybody died, I totally freaked out. I was like, "What just happened?" <laughs> that was good, though, y'all. Thank you. And I hear him. They kind of. And if you need to get a uh, banner or hit point of spike, you can run around this water over here. And if you really want to piss your party off, if you're a monk and you have, uh, or you're in Grandmaster Flowers and you have everything is nothing, while you're still fighting the red name, do everything is nothing and watch Harry come down and beat the crap out of him. Or start throwing fireballs. Fireball. Teleporting people up. <laughs>